Welcome to Streaming Deluxe, presented by Mr. Orange. My name is Mr. Orange and welcome back to my great series upcoming PC games on Steam. So I normally I always make this uh, make those videos when I see there's something interesting uh, on the popular upcoming release list on Steam. So and uh, I made one uh, some days ago. So uh, since then already so many other very very interesting games are listed so I, I now want to talk talk uh, to you about those games so let's uh, let's jump into into it immediately so last time as you know I talked about um, about Sekiro Shadows died twice uh, we talked about Resident Evil Metro Biomutant etc so those are amazing games and when those games I think they become very very popular and we're all going to buy them and love them and play them so no need to talk talk about them now but I want to talk about games that are now coming like uh, in a few days and for example I I would just start now yeah let's let's check out immediately this for example this fishing sim world so I mean we let's say we all know no one really plays fishing not a lot those fishing simulators exist but we do not really often play them and I actually I really want to buy myself one fishing simulator I don't know yet if I want to buy myself a fishing simulator for VR or or a normal one I guess it's more fun in VR but then you don't have those graphics and uh, for everyone for each person that played uh, Far Cry Five, I think the fishing simulator there was also pretty cool and Final Fantasy 15 also has a fishing simulator so I'm going to put this game on my wish list so it's so it is coming on it was coming on the 18th of September the the reviews are mixed so i think it might have been uh, oh pre-release review okay a lot of negative reviews of oh, guys yeah I'm, I'm leaving it anyways i'm leaving it on my uh, wish list so yeah but let's go and check out other games i think this shit looks also very interesting the name is speed pro and the game is developed by double stallion games published by Congrate. So what is this game about? Action, indie, beat them up to the fighter fighting. Okay, that sounds really fun actually. So I, I like this kind of game, so pixel beaten up to the fighter. It reminds me of the good old times of uh, with my new new geo neo geo new geo uh, my Super Nintendo and later my uh, Dreamcast. So yeah, it comes in two days. I'm definitely putting it on my wish list. So that's that looks really cool. So what do you think about this game? Write me in the commentary section. What's your opinion about this? 2D combat, combat race about moving fast and hitting hard. Maintain your momentum, build your combos and unleash powerful special moves. Find your own fighting style and assemble the finest team of brawlers ever seen. So very, very cool, very nice. So what is another game? I thought I saw this before and I thought this actually also looks really cool. So the name is Whirlit Swing. Flame Bait Gapes coming on the 18th of September. Pretty cool atmosphere, pretty cool music. I like the graphics. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Putting it definitely on my wish list. Is it for VR? Let's check. No, it's not for VR. In the action. Okay, very interesting game. I think uh, that's uh, one where you can uh, keep an eye on. And now an indie adventure VR game. The name is Blind. Tiny Ball Studios Fellow Traveler. Navigate an unfamiliar world in virtual reality using echolocation. Echolocation, okay, that's very, very special. Where sounds become Im images. Trapped in a mansion by the devious warden make your way through its many rooms riddled with puzzles and dangers moving ever closer to the truth and your only chance to escape guys yeah the idea looks funny so it comes in two days there's the price tag on it no price tag yet 
Yeah, why why not? It's it's actually a cool idea to to make a game where where the sound is uh, creating the images. But on the other hand, you play the uh, head mounted display, and uh, and you want to see through your head mounted display, so you you don't really hear, so you see and hear at the same time. Bit confusing, isn't it? <laughs> Anyways, I'm putting it on my wish list. So my might be an interesting game. Oh, what's that? The Bard's Tale for Barris Deep. Bard's Tale is a popular series. Most iconic RPG series. Uh, I remember playing them back in the days. In Exile Entertainment coming on the 18th September. Price tag almost 35 euros. Dungeon Coral turn based. Uh, you know, I don't like a turn based strategy tactic game so much, but. I really really like but I really really like their their style here oh it looks good I'm just jumping a little bit here oh yeah I saw, saw something about this uh, on on some footages from the e3 and also from the gamescom so it's actually the the fighting uh, system uh, is interesting so let's jump here in the video so you see your here you see your your, your characters and the enemies and then they are both okay it, this feels like exactly the game i hoped the bot tales for would be PC gamer combines the best of both classic dungeon crawling and modern RPGs. Dungeon Master is a game that I remember. I played this on the Atari ST a lot, so do you remember Dungeon Master guys? <laughs> Never finished it, of course not. So it was very difficult back in the days. Well, I'm putting on my wish list. It's not especially in the game, I guess, that I'm going to going to buy but who knows who knows ah oh, yeah i saw this at the gamescom i i wanted to play it uh, in the in, at ubisoft but uh, while well, there were too many people so this this looks very interesting i really like this uh, i make a full screen of it oh yeah it's like a real movie so i think that's going to be a great uh, Finally, some uh, some VR game again from from a major studio. So, I think that's going to be great. Uh, it can actually also change the the way how we watch movies or series, uh, mixing virtual reality with movie series. Uh, damn it, guys, that's creepy. <laughs> yeah, let's do this also. Whatever he's doing. He looks. It looks like he has has some nerdy hobby. Hmm. <laughs> Actually, um, I get scared by those VR games sometimes. So, I get mosque. I don't get scared by any games or uh, any normal 2D games uh, or, or movies or series. But uh, VR games are pretty scary because something like this happens. I mean, come on. I, I can, since I know, since I have a VR glasses, I know how this is going to feel. So you look, you look back and you see, you see those, those weird red eyes, monsters, and come on. Escape corrupted mine. Oh my god, guys. I think this. This game is going to be great. Two days. Oh wow, Shh, that's cool. So it's coming now. Um, I'm in Western Europe, so the game is. Sort of yeah, I'm games. stopping here. This game is coming then in on Monday. Wow, that's cool. Definitely going to to play this. So a game by Ubisoft. What do you think about uh, Transference? Is it the game that you're going to purchase? I guess if you have a. Head mounted display, that's very much possible. 
Age of Civilizations, as you know, that's not the kind of game that I play. On the other hand, I, I want to get in those games, so I think they, but they look so much like work, so so you have to, you have to learn them, you have to play them for for hours and hours on, on 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 uh, until you actually understand how <laughs> how the system works. So it looks like a very difficult system. So there's Luxembourg, my home country. And a lot of uh, German little states. So in German they call it Flickenteppich. Very cool. What's the, what's Rune? Oh, guys, haven't seen this. Let's check out this game. Rise, warrior. Your time. So Ragnarok game. Has come again. They made another game. I I forgot what it is. Okay, Vikings are en vogue, so the game with Vikings is now. So with For, Hon For Honor, etc., this really, really got a trendy, uh, trendy setting. But I would say it looks fun. Graphics not very special, but you have some huge trolls, so. So let's check a bit here. Early access core action RPG, Ragnarok, the end of days. And uh, Pillage where Midgar become the God Slayer. Uh, I'm putting it on my wish list, so it's coming this winter. Let's see if it's going to be interesting. Yes, and that's it guys for this this series of the upcoming PC game game releases on steam so if you're interested in boob saga then check out one of my other videos <laughs> already talked about this i don't know i always have to look at this boob saga so i'm sorry for this yeah guys so if you if you're interested also in some of my other videos check them out uh, give me a subscription of my channel i'm going to continue to to produce uh, every day or at least uh, every second day a video i also make giveaways on my in my steam group i also have a steam curator group i'm on facebook and twitter you can also follow me there and uh, yeah and, and i'm announcing my giveaways uh, regularly so don't worry um and yeah give me a thumbs up for the video if you liked it if you don't like it give me some down i mean it's your opinion so guys i thank you very much for watching have a great day